take your cheese Our dear Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Lord, we want to thank you so much for your goodness, for your mercies, for your hand of our lives, for your grace, O oh God, for loving us with such great compassion, with such an eternal love, O oh God, that this morning we are in your presence, Lord. You look at us as your children, and we are your people, a people of your shepherd. Father, we thank you for looking on us with your mercies today. We thank you, Lord, for the fact that you have seen us as families, as a country, O oh God. We thank you, Lord, for your wonderful works of our lives. And Father, this morning we pause in your presence to just say thank you for sustaining us, for keeping us well, O oh God, we say thank you. And Lord, we welcome you into this time, Jehovah God, that as we continue to fellowship through this devotion, Lord, would you speak to our hearts, would you encourage our hearts, would you uplift us today to your glory and honor. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Good morning and thank you so much for tuning in to today's prayer and devotion. We are so glad that you could join us. This week we have been looking at uh, and focusing on different aspects, thanking God for his goodness, for his grace, even as we look forward to Sunday, our Thanksgiving Sunday as a church. And today we are going to be praying and just thanking God for making us victorious over sin. Because you know, Christians face temptations. We do face temptations now and then tri trials and troubles and you know sometimes these things can make us or can cause us to fall into sin but you want to thank God today because he has already given us victory over sin and we'll read from the scripture of first um, Corinthians chapter 15 verse 57 the Bible says, But thanks be to God, he gives us victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my dear brother, stand firm, let nothing move you. Always give yourselves fully to the work of the Lord, because you know that your labor in the Lord is not in vain. But thanks be to God, who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. As we focus on thanksgiving, you know, we want to thank God for the gift of salvation. And beyond that, that God gives us victory through our Lord Jesus Christ, who is our personal savior. And so today, regardless of where we find ourselves, regardless of the temptations that come our way, we can stand firm, we can, uh, we, we can be immovable, we can be bold. We, the scripture tells us, let nothing move us. 
let nothing move us even when temptations come our way we reflect back and we know that yes this is a temptation but thanks be to God who gives us victory through our Lord Jesus Christ so this morning take a moment if you have received the gift of salvation you know that there is grace to overcome temptation there's grace of forgiveness there's grace for us to keep asking God for mercy and even beyond that that he has already made us victorious over sin over the temptations over trials over over troubles that come our way so let's go ahead and thank God for the gift of salvation and even for the gift that he has given us victory already through Christ Jesus and whatever we you could be struggling with this morning any area of the, of uh, addiction or bondage of captivity we can lift it to God in prayer thanking him because even in that area where you feel stuck in that area where you feel like you have been in bondage for so long he has already given us victory through our lord jesus christ shall we pray our god and our father we want to say thank you Lord you are reminding us this morning that you have given us victory over sin victory to overcome temptations victory to overcome sin oh God we give you praise my father we come with a posture of thanksgiving Lord we look back at our lives we see where you have brought us from my God individually my father but even as a church oh God the different journeys that you have walked with each one of us oh God from the time we came to confess and to know you as our lord and savior and even through our different journeys of faith oh God indeed lord this morning we can say thank you for making us victorious over sin thank you lord for saving us from bondage from for saving us from captivity Thank you Lord for saving us from sin oh God. We want to say thank you for your mercies that speak on our behalf. Lord we want to say thank you for your grace that has been so sufficient. We want to say thank you Lord for your hand that is not short to save oh God. And even this morning Jehovah you're telling us my God that you have you have made us victorious through our Lord Jesus Christ. Lord we give you praise and we give you glory. We want to pray my Father that as we continue with our journey of faith Lord would you cause us to stand firm lord would you cause us oh god to take our space to take our position oh god and let let nothing move us oh jehovah god may we live lives that honor you may we labor for you oh dear god may we serve you king of all glory knowing so well my father that which you have already done for us in the mighty name of jesus Lord even as we give thanks to you this morning we want to lift anyone among us oh God who could be struggling with an area of sin my father Lord we thank you because you came to set captives free you came oh God to save to to save and to set free those in bondage Lord you came so that we could be free and free indeed oh God and you tell us in your word that he who the son sets free is free indeed Jehovah we stand in the gap on behalf of our sisters and brothers who could be struggling in sin oh god in bondages jehovah father we want to declare today oh god according to your word that father you have made you have made us victorious you have given us victory in our lord jesus christ we have victory through our lord jesus christ so father we pray that as temptations come our way lord will remember to stand firm will remember to run to the name of jesus will remember to call on jesus through whom we are made victorious will remember to trust in jesus through through whom lord we are victorious over sin to your glory and honor and praise so father today we desire to live lives that are holy lives that are honorable before you lives that please you oh god how we pray king of all glory that you will walk with us the lord you will hold our hands we pray today my father that let the words of our mouth and the meditations of our heart oh god be acceptable and be pleasing to you to your name and to your glory my father So God we surrender ourselves to you. We pray oh God that you will keep us safe, you will watch over us in our going out and in our coming in. Lord would you satisfy us with your mercies and with your goodness. In Jesus name we pray. Amen and amen. Thank you so much for tuning in. Have a blessed day ahead and see you on Sunday. See what the Lord has done. Oh see what the Lord Come 
tu paz si va da lore hasta oh si va da lore hasta hasta to me si va da lore hasta what we waited for he has come to What we wear. 